uh, a documentary element. So we'll be hearing the special music any minute now, and the crew from the film Four Daughters will float up the red carpet. Sur le tapis rouge, la réalisatrice Kauter Benania, l'actrice et productrice Anne Sabri, les interprètes Olfa Amouni, Eya Shiraoui, Pessin Shiraoui. Lou Karawi, Ishak Matara, Maj Mastouro. is a real live woman and the film is all about her and her daughters her four daughters two of whom have disappeared how well take a look at the film and then you will find out but Kauta Ben Hanya decides to replace the two missing daughters with two actresses and the whole subject of the film is to understand how on earth the family got there how did it all happen Yes, Kauta Ben Hanya has made other films. She made Beauty and the Dogs, which was screened in Cannes, in fact, at the uh, uh, Saint Regard. And then in 2020, there was The Man Who Sold His Skin, which uh, featured Monica Bellucci. And that film was in the uh, official selection at the Venice Film Festival. Kauta Ben Hanya says of herself, that she is uh, a documentary maker with a few lies thrown in. She likes to mix fiction in with her documentaries. And we have proof of that this evening with Four Daughters. This film will be released in France on the 5th of July. Not too long to wait, therefore. And who knows, in a few days' time, it might be given a prize. So, suspense. When you're watching the TV, it might be difficult to grasp the number of films that we're seeing here and but quite soon you'll be able to go out and see them yourselves my wens film for example which was not in competition but which opened the festival has already been released in france starring johnny depp pierre richard benjamin laverne my wen herself Noah Milovsky, Pascal Grégory. You can go and see all of those actors and actresses at the movies. Whilst waiting for the list of winners at the end of the festival and also the different release dates of the different films being screened here. The crew from the film Four Daughters, directed by Kaura Ben Hanya. We have Olfa Hamruni, Hen Sabri, Aya Shikawi, Taisi Shikawi, Noor Karwi, Ishrak Mata, and Majd Mastura. So we have some professional actors in there, some non professional actors as well real life characters and fictitious characters. There's a political thread running through the film because the director says without this Arab Spring, my movies would never have been able to be made. It 
In the film, Alpha says there was a revolution. Ben Ali fell, and I took advantage of that to carry out my own revolution. And then she goes on to explain about her own love life. So. History with a capital H ties in with the story of, uh, of these women. And at the end of the film, she says, I wanted to tell this story in this film to break, make a clean break from the past. Now we have Thierry Frémaux on this rainy can evening, waiting to greet the team from the film Four Daughters. This is such an event. It's the first Tunisian film to be in competition for 50 years. And this, the filmmaker is a woman. The ladies are climbing up those 24 steps with the one actor, male actor. And they will be going into the movie theater with 2,500 seats in it for the world premiere screening. Some members of the jury will be in there to watch the film. There are 21 films in competition this year. So this is a very moving and beautiful red carpet ceremony. We saw the ladies swaying to the music. They're smiling. Let me just wipe a tear from my eye. Alpha looks a little bit nervous there because this isn't a film, it isn't a, just a story, it's her life that's going to be up there on the big screen. So we will say farewell for the time being, we'll be back on the red carpet later. Voilà l'ensemble de, de l'équipe des filles d'Olfa, film tunisien. En haut des marches du Palais des Festivals, la Tunisie en compétition pour ce 76e Festival de Cannes. Représenté par la réalisatrice Kaouter Benania. Dernier regard sur la nuit canoise. So the crew from the film has now entered into the festival hall. They'll go down to row I, which is reserved exclusively for them, and the screening can commence. We'll be with you until they reach row I. Enjoy your evening. And we'll be back in a couple of hours for the next red carpet. Okay.